Welcome to another one of our videos. I'm AJ from Savory Thoughts and today I'm going to show you how to make Saviority biscuits or lady fingers. These are very delicate, enjoyable lady fingers. And why are they called lady fingers? Because they have the beautiful shape of an actual woman's finger. So how it came about that I have to make those? I actually need it for my tiramisu recipe and I could not find it anywhere in the stores. So I ended up figuring, hey, how about I make the recipe? So here it is, I'm sharing it with you. Let's get started. We will start by sifting our flour, baking soda, and cornstarch. As a reminder, if you find a process that we take helpful, don't forget to give us a like, subscribe into our channel. You will also find the exact measurement of this recipe on our website at savorythoughts.com. Go ahead and add a pinch of salt into the sifted flour. Now the fun part is separating the eggs. If you have an egg separator, so go ahead and use it. So we're gonna separate the whites from the yolk. This is the heart of your Saviority cookies or lady fingers. Making sure that the egg whites are properly stiffened. In mixing the yolk, make sure to add your vanilla flavoring and your sugar and make sure to combine it until the sugar is completely dissolved. It might also be very helpful to use a hand mixture to allow the process to go much easier. So what is the hype and what is so special about lady fingers? Well, it is because they are versatile. They can easily be used on their own to enjoy with some nice cup of tea or coffee, whatever you may like. But they are also great addition to other desserts. Tiramisu, one of them. That's one of the main reasons why I'm even making this recipe. Now once you are done with the egg yolk, let's go ahead and start with the egg whites. First thing first, make sure that you rinse off your electric mixer if you are using one before you apply it in the egg whites. Now for the egg whites, this should take you about five minutes to beat it. Do not over beat it. It has to give you that beautiful stiff texture when you remove the mixer that the egg white actually stands up like a peak of a mountain. Now, I personally believe that the reason the Saviority cookies are named Lady Fingers, it is actually because they are, it is so delicate to make. So when you apply the egg whites into the beaten yolk, you have to fold it and that takes time. You cannot rush it. It has to be folded and not stirred. And of course, once you are done folding the egg combination, now it's time to fold in the flour. And yes, you have to fold it. Don't stir it. Mm -hmm. 
And again, the exact measurement for our Saviority Biscuit recipe is on our website at savorythoughts.com. And we have many other dessert recipes and of course, our Haitian foods on there. So feel free to check it out. All right, so now that you've completed the mixture, using a decorative bag, Go ahead and use a glass or a cup to make it easier for you to transfer the batter into the bag. Go ahead and fold the tip of the bag inside the glass. This is just to keep the batter from going all the way to the bottom. Cut about one and a half to two inches off your pastry bag or decorative bag and then go ahead and spread the mixture into your baking pan. The cookies are typically about two inches long but if you feel like making yours longer, it's your prerogative. Go ahead and bake the cookies just about one to two inches apart. That should be sufficient for the cookies to spread if they need to. As a reminder, Savior Yarder cookies do not take a long time to bake. 10 minutes is sufficient for you to enjoy these goodness. And that's it folks. If you have enjoyed our Savior Yardy recipe or Lady Fingers recipe, please don't forget to give us a like, subscribe to our channel, leave a comment and let us know what are the recipes you'll like to see.